Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a best friend tag of my friend here, Lynzetta. You guys can go to her YouTube and subscribe to her at official official Lynn. And um her Instagram is official underscore Lynn, so you guys can go follow her on that too. I'll have it linked down in the description. It's your best friend's birthday. Would they prefer a surprise party or something chill? Something chill. Surprise party. Who's a better cook? Me. I really am the better cook, but it's okay. No, like, dead ass, like. I know. Which friend does the homework and which one copies? I do the homework. <laughs> <laughs> Even though, like, when we're in college now, like, we go to different schools, but, like, I'll call her and be like, hey, like, can you believe my homework? Like, do you wanna, like, do, do you wanna sign it for me? I love you. For no money. Friendship bucks. Cameron taught me about those. He was like, oh, yeah. oh that was how much I was here. He was like, oh, yeah, I'll do that for like five friendship bucks. I was like, okay, bet. <laughs> Does your friend have any pets and what are their names? Yours is Mocha and Marley. It's a hamster that's Mocha and Marley is a brown bat. Hers is, um, and oh well, she just told me her fish's name like two seconds ago it's her name is oscar it's been like two years <laughs> i don't remember like she has a new fish every single time like she always kills them. no i don't um, if you were on a deserted island what items would you and your friend not live without so like something we both would bring air mattress that is not what I would bring on a deserted island out of all the things that I could bring. Okay, water. Unlimited water. Yeah, but it's not real. Something that you can hold. Your phone. No. It's not gonna work if I'm on a deserted island. No, I can't call anybody. I'll probably bring like some matches. A, so I can cook. B, so I can stay warm when it gets cold. Duh. Cause I don't know okay. how to make a fire. What would I bring then? You just said everything you probably bring at air mattress, I guess. No, because what I'm blowed up with if we're on a deserted island, dummy. You don't want who just said it and you calling me dumb. Okay. Um, a pan. For what? To cook? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what you gonna cook it in your hand? You gonna get a stick and put it over the fire. No. That's what I, I would like do. Little packages like the ash. What? You would bring packages? Yeah, it's like No, you can bring I'm one like, thing. So if you bring ramen, you bring one ramen. You can't have like a whole bunch of If stuff. I brought one thing, it'd be a so I could just end it already. Because I can't do that. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> what is my go-to breakup song? You don't have one. I feel like yours is I can't trust. No. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, probably. One of them. One of, I got a whole list. Cause, but, um, now that Janae Aiko came out with Trigger, probably that. Um, that's probably the main one you'll have on replay. And, like, sprinkle a little Mariah Carey. Okay. I can see that. Um, describe your best friend in one word. Why am I going first? Okay. I could, you look like you don't got nothing nice to say about me. Look at your face. It's not bad. Okay. I'm just trying to think. Okay. First, see I'll this first. interpretation? I'll just first. trash. I'll go first. Okay. Um, I feel like one thing that I could say about you is your um strong-willed or like strong-minded or strong-willed. Is that how you say it? Strong-minded. Well, I think like, it's the will yeah i think that i think that's what i would say that's how i would describe you um i would is there a word for that hold on let me think approximately 10 hours later yeah my mind went blank i know a word i want but like i i don't want to say dreamer but it's like along those lines like because like you know, like what you want. Like a star dancer. No, 
like a dreamer like you have like your idea of what you want for your life and like all of that and like how you're gonna get it like it's like you already know what you want and you're just trying to like go through the motions of getting what you want you know what i mean mm-hmm. we ever fought like how i don't know just as how we ever fought face fight no we yeah. don't do that over here yeah that's that's right we wouldn't be friends <laughs> yeah that's ratchet um fought as an argument all the time yeah <laughs> does your friend judge of who you date oh like oh like do you judge like like do we judge who we talk to like i guess like who we date or who we're talking to yes yes definitely not as not as much as we used to but yeah because somebody was very opinionated and i was not wrong but um yeah i think we're we both have very strong opinions on um the other person's choice in it's in like a good way like we don't ever judge the best interest for you yeah guys. like it's not like oh because of like us like that it'll we'll look at it for them you know yeah because i've definitely can't yeah, get my neck against that <laughs> <laughs> um what is my idea of a dream date the beach yeah that would be nice but like say like somewhere around here like It would be maybe nice, like, like a beach day is cute. Like maybe, like, something creative, anything creative. Yeah, like, you just have to be, like, out of the box. Like, just don't do the same thing that everybody's doing. Me. I feel like, um, like a picnic. No, because yeah. I don't like eating in front of them. But I would go, oh, like... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or, okay, like, maybe, like, something like a paint and sip or, like... Maybe, like, on our own. Because I'm, like, I don't like, like being in front of them. Oh, like, yeah. Like, something secluded. Or like, um, yeah, like not like dinner or anything like that. Yeah, like I really Unless, like. Unless like you're already dating them. So. Yeah, like I like really at home stuff. Well, not at home, but like stuff you have to be crafty for. Like something creative, but not like in terms like, of maybe her going creative. to the park and then like bringing like some uh, what's it called? Paint? No. The thing you paint on. A canvas. Yeah. Bring like some canvases. Buy some like. 50 cent paints or something and brushes yeah, that would so be cute. cute yeah that's really cute and then you just have like with my too. date like i need some snacks like some some wine some snacks oh we can have wine <laughs> some cheese some crackers some salami Ew, no, not some that. grapes do just that. like a picnic but like painting too <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh. i really want a car date like bring a laptop in a car and like oh like set up the, the back track if they have thing. a big car yeah that's cute that is cute what do you appreciate most about our friendship? How, like, comfortable it is. Yeah. Not really that many, like, high expectations. Like, kind of like, whenever, like, you're with new friends, just like, oh my god. Yeah. It's just different. Like, I, it's not like, like we've you definitely to had too like, hard, but it's just like. We've had growing, um, growing pains where we had to, like, readjust. And we're still, like, going through growing pains because we're, like, in 20s and uh, 21 plus. yeah 21 plus so as the time's going we're just gonna have to readjust and it's gonna always be like shifting but it's like mm, pretty easy for the most part like yeah we don't like anything that adds stress i feel like the thing yes preach <laughs> i feel like um the thing that like i appreciate most about our friendship is that like <laughs> Is that like our parents are kind of like extra parents? Like that, like our families are kind of like close knit and like kind of like honestly, we're like if families, it wasn't for like our we're families, all family. I really feel like we wouldn't be friends because we would get mad at each other when we were younger and like we used to be real brats. Be like, Mom, come pick me up now. Our parents used to be talking shit about she us. She did that. No, because you was here. See and how she gets loud like that? That's what I'm talking about, bro. That's what I'm talking about from earlier. What's your favorite inside joke? Dang. I know. I know one. What's in my Oh, wait. What's in my What are her strengths? Let's see. I feel like for you, like, your strengths are that, like, Let me go first. I'm already ready. Okay. 
okay so your strengths are you're like you don't really care like you kind of go against the grain and like you'll do whatever you want regardless of anyone else is doing it i feel like that's a strength because that's how you went on your trip that's how you went to southern you found your fashion groups and stuff like that you're into that you're about to get your internships you know what i mean yeah like very independent but you know she's also only child so that might play into it too but like she's very like non-dependent of like what she wants she knows what she wants to do as well like she's very like decisive in that way and decisive and like follows through what do you mean follows through like when you say you want to do something you pretty much do it yeah. like you want to do cheer you did cheer you want to go to southern you went to southern you wanted to live in a certain spot you live there yeah yeah um i feel like for you like one thing that like you are really like good at or well, i guess like a strength mm -hmm. would be like your like ability to like bring up others like around you and like kind of like not put yourself first even though like sometimes you be posting all this stuff y'all have a bunch of social media whatever you <laughs> talk about like oh i'm selfish like fuck all y'all okay let me say not say that but like you know like i really no, I do be saying like she's like, she like oh, you know like i'm really not messing with none of y'all like i really can get out of my face but like when it comes down to it <laughs> like, like, like when it comes down to it like she like does a really good job of like making sure people around her are straight even if like they like did something what's wrong to her but there's been people that like i've been like bruh like no like you can't give them another chance but she'd be like well i'm so understanding to a fault sometimes but i'll be getting my but I feel like that's, that could be a strength though cause like I feel like I don't let people walk over me like I feel like I'm understanding in ways and like I don't really end stuff on bad terms mm -hmm. cause like what's the point like I don't have like no ill feelings towards anybody like right, right now like I do argue hard I do but I always have like conversations to have clear clarity and stuff yeah what is my middle name? Nicole Andrea <laughs> thanks for watching that clap was so nasty wait wait thanks for watching Ew, no, it's thanks for watching come back again make sure you follow us the links will be in the description box below there's a horror button here. below below the the links will be in the description box below <laughs> Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and just make sure you comment down below anything that you want to see maybe us two do together in another video. And You're going to have to wait till this girl get back home because she go to school three hours away. Ha! Sorry. <laughs> and, like, make sure y'all go to her channel, subscribe to her channel and at Official Lynn. And, yeah. Um, I'll see you in the next video, and thank you guys for watching.